And as you know, there are so many good things happening on main streets and downtowns across the Magnolia State. So today we get to highlight what's happening downtown this weekend. It is brought to you by the Mississippi Main Street Association. And don't you forget, you can always go to msmainstreet.com slash calendar to get more information on upcoming events. And first up for you this week is out of Clinton. Man, they got a busy week going on. And Tara is joining us to tell us a little bit more. So, hey, Tara. Hi, Rebecca. Thanks for having me. Absolutely. Y'all got a busy weekend there in Clinton, Mississippi. What all y'all got going? We do. We love to just cram it full of activities. Uh, Well, uh, we're kicking off our weekend early on Thursday night. We have our um, trivia night. We call it Old Town After Dark Trivia. That's at 303 Jefferson um, at 730. And so that's uh, just kind of general trivia and just a fun, fun time to kick off the weekend. And then we followed that up on Friday with a dinner and a movie. Uh, this movie we're showing this time is Footloose, so original Footloose. So we've had uh, that on our uh, watch list for some time, and we're able to get it scheduled for this fall. So everybody seems to be looking forward to that. We'll have a food truck there. We're going to have hot tamale heaven, um, and we'll have uh kettle corn so uh, that'll be available for purchase but the movie is free um and then we saturday is our real big day uh downtown we have our 15th annual cruise and clinton car show and so that show usually has 100 or 115 cars in the show we kick it off with a vintage car parade and it's we say cars but it's really vehicles you'll see trucks and motorcycles and really just kind of open to all makes and models um of vehicles um, and that will kick off at 9 o'clock from our Clinton Plaza Shopping Center and kind of wind through town, and then it'll end up in Old Town for the show. And so the show starts uh, public viewing 10 to, to 1. Um, and then another thing that we've added to the show a couple of years ago was a big truck experience where the kids can get up close and personal with all types of work vehicles and police cars and first uh, first responder vehicles. So that's been a real highlight, and that is, that's sponsored by Vermeer. So it sounds like a busy weekend. Tara, when you're talking about the trivia coming up on Thursday night, do you let them know, like, the, um, I guess, the topic or the range of trivia, or is it just show up and see what you got? Yeah, so really you just show up and see what you got. General trivia for most of them. We do a Harry Potter trivia in October, um, so they do know, you know, that one uh, is uh, coming up. But the other is just general. You'll, you know, all kind of pop culture, history, sports, you name it, it gets it gets thrown into the mix. So with the car show, I know this is a big deal um, for you guys. Is it still, can people, if they want to bring their cars, is there still yeah. room to sign up to be in the car show, or is that kind of already closed? Yeah. And how does that work? So the online has closed just because there's a lot of you know prep work that goes in, but they can register on site. Um, so we'll t- start taking registrations at 8 o'clock on Saturday morning at Clinton Plaza Shopping Center. Um, and usually we'll pick up another 30 or 40 cars day of. So um, anyway, so it is. It's a big day, and we encourage anybody that wants to come be a part to, to join us. And if they have questions, they can certainly call the Main Street office. We'd be glad to answer any questions. I see on the poster there's a slight charge, which I understand why. But does that get you in for both the car show as well as the big truck experience, Tara, or are those separate events? So the the fee is for to register a car. Oh, if you're okay. not showing a car, there's no expense to the general public to come and view the you know, view the cars or bring their kids to the big truck experience. That's that's free because we have great sponsors that help make that free to the public. Well even better, Tara. Yeah. If folks mix missed any of this and they want to know what's going on at Clinton at any time, where can they find you? They can call the Main Street office, 601-924-5472. They can follow us on social media, Main Street Clinton, on uh, Facebook or Instagram, or they can certainly go to the Main Street Clinton website. That's just MainStreetClintonMS.com. All righty. Well, looking forward to what you got going on this weekend and hoping for good weather for you guys, Tara. It sounds like it's going to be hopefully a beautiful weekend for what you all have going on there in Clinton. Thank you so much, Rebecca. We appreciate it. All righty. If you're not in the Clinton area, though, maybe you're headed to Starkville area and you want to have something fun to do. They've always got fun things going on in their downtown and on their main street. And Paige Watson is joining us uh, today to tell us a little bit more about what's happening this weekend. Welcome back, Paige. Thank you so much, Rebecca and Rene, for having me today. Well, it's always a good time. You always have the most unique um, events that happen there in Starkville, as well as other places throughout the state. But you guys seem to always come up with the cutest names and the fun things to do. So what do you have uh, new for us? 
So this Friday, um, two days from now, we have our Untapped downtown. So we are so excited. This is kind of a play on words from our really popular Unwind. Um, so this is a craft beer festival. Um, so we have over 10 different retailers, and they're all going to have a different craft beer provided by uh, Mitchell Distributing and, of course, our hometown guys, Clark Beverage. And um, you can purchase a ticket from us at the Bank of Commerce Lawn. They're our generous sponsor. And you can shop and try all these fun craft beers and just kind of hang out downtown so it's a really good vibe and it's a great event and we love hosting it but yeah so we have untapped so again just kind of like our, our i would say our brother event to unwind i was gonna say is this geared more towards the gentlemen like are there more men directed stores that are open and doing things or is it kind of just you know ladies like beer too and men like when to- like wine also so that's but it does feel like maybe this is lending a little bit more to getting our husbands and such out to come shopping with us yeah funny you say that um there's a lot of men that do purchase tickets for this because they love seeing what we have on tap if you will um but a lot of the shoppers are still women that just happen to be in the right place at the right time if you know what i mean so (laughs) i think it's really fun for all and that's what we love about it well, and it's also just something different because we, um, you know, the unwind kind of events, they're really popular, and I don't think they're going anywhere, but why not shake it up and give people the opportunity to uh, experience something new? And if nothing else, he'll get brownie points for just getting out of the house and going to Main Street and sitting and saying he's in the vicinity while she has the opportunity uh, to shop or, or, you know, whatever it is that they want to do. That's right, and one of my favorite parts about it is seeing our uh, local retailers kind of put their own spin on it. For instance, Mississippi Eyewear, um, Tabitha and her team, they are so creative. They love events. They go all out, and they're going to have, um, in addition to their craft beer that they're serving, they're going to have, a, I think, a Gatorade or a Haterade um, to kind of play off the Florida Gators coming to town this Saturday. So it's definitely something for everybody to do of all ages, and um, we're just we're excited about it. And the Bank of Commerce, their lawn, they're our sponsor for this event. Their lawn is one of our my favorite places downtown. Um, it's within walking distance of our main two blocks of Main Street, and we're going to have live music there by the Sharp Sisters. Um, they're a great duo that does acoustic 90s, um, all your favorite hits. Uh, and they really are sisters, so we're excited to have live music and um, just have everybody kind of come out. And it's it's a very casual event, but it lasts from 5.30 to 8.30. So kind of all night if you come uh, to downtown Starkville, you'll see everybody everywhere and you'll get invited in. So Do you need tickets, page prior to, or can you, can you get them? I don't know if there's really a door, if there's kind of like an entry or how you'll have that sort of um, squared off. Or, and yeah. is there are there things like, is there beverages at each location or is it just one like tent or sort of area with the with the tap beer. Yeah, um, no, so every uh, retailer that's participating is getting a different tap beer for you to sample. Um, so it's really a great deal. Tickets are online right now and will be through Friday at noon for only $20 um, on our Instagram and on our Facebook pages. If you just search the event untapped um, and click on the Facebook event, they'll pop up and you can um, just Google Start Mall Untapped and it'll come right up. And uh, we will sell any remaining tickets that we have left on the lawn that evening during check in because you, you go to the bank, you get your cup. You get the menu that tells you where to go and what everybody has, and then you kind of just go on your merrily way. And enjoy it. So, yeah. Paige, I know that uh, it's just just starting the fall season. In fact, we had our false fall. I feel like summer's back, which <laughs> lends itself good to some of the things uh, we have going on on weekends. But I know the fall's just around the corner. Is there another event that you want folks to go ahead and, like, pin on their calendar for what's going on in Startful? Absolutely. Uh, Less than a month from now, uh, we have Unwind. So, again, like I said, (laughs) these two events kind of accompany each other. And so Unwind is hosted by Bank of Kilmichael, and we are so excited that they are sponsoring again. And so it is very similar to Untapped, but it's with the wine. Um, And tickets are already on sale for that, and that website's unwinddowntown.com. But that event is going to be Friday, October 18th, and it will be the A&M game weekend. So. I love that y'all <laughs> pair these with the uh, weekends. Encourage folks to come into Startful maybe yeah. a night earlier if they haven't. See the yeah. city and shop in a different way. Take advantage of an event that's not just tied to football and get the full experience. I think it's a cool thing. Yes, we want our opponents to have a great time in Startful as well. And, and of course, our locals do always. So. I love that. All right, I thank you for your time, Paige. Thank you, Rebecca. You guys have a great weekend. You too. And don't you forget, you can always go to msmainstreet.com slash calendar to get more information on upcoming events any weekend. But stick with us. we got some fun for you coming up next.